Hello everyone and welcome back to Terra Firmacraft. So today we're finally going to get round to making a beehive kiln, which I was meant to do last episode but just didn't get time to. So I apologise for the lack of completing stuff. There's, there's quite a lot to do in this so if I do get carried away with other stuff I do apologise. Ooh, I've got some berries. Excellent. Uh, we'll leave them for a minute. Right, so what we want to do is we want to get some bricks. Luckily, we've got quite a lot of these now. And we do have... Yes, there we go. Also, I think... I don't think we need a hammer. No, so that's fine. Just make these into this. And we're going to need some sand... So, just to give an example, we just need lime water and some sand, pop that in, water comes out. However, we need a lot. <laughs> so what we're going to have to do is go to the beach. I think, luckily, there's one nearby. And grab some there. Uh... I forgot you can play instruments with the jug if you right-click and it's empty. Oh, oh, the jug broke. I've got a spare, it's fine. Right, so let's go to the beach first. Oh, no, let's go to the beach. Uh, just to let you know, guys, no, I've also set up a couple of other pages. So I've set up a Discord channel as well. So if you've got any suggestions about the channel or you just want to see updates through Discord... Um, I'll leave a link in the description below. I've also set up... Ooh, I did notice that I was here. I've also started an Instagram page. I'm not really used to Instagram, but I think it would be quite nice to show you guys kind of where I live and do updates through that, kind of just as I edit videos and that sort of thing. So let's get some sand. Oh. So we need quite a few of these. I'll take everything off, aren't I? Go, go, go. There's a fun mechanic in TFC that I've, I keep forgetting about, which I think it's if you have something heavy in your backpack, or maybe it's just the amount of stuff you have in your backpack, you will just sink. Like that you just sink to the bottom i don't know if you need to have something actually heavy in your in your inventory for it to happen but it's quite cool because oh no I, i'm floating now okay that's fine you hold shift to sink but if you happen to have i think it's like a large barrel or something in your inventory you will just sink to the bottom without having to make yourself sink which i do find really cool well, it's unknown sand, which I still don't really know what that's about. But we'll um, we'll have a look in a sec. Right, back to base. Ah, uh. okay. Oh, I didn't know we had some of this over here. More jute. Always deal with more jute. Do we have the pro pick on us now? I was going to see if there's anything down there. Probably is. Probably where the uh, zinc is. Probably a cave or something. Oh well. Cool, cool, cool. Right, let us finally make some mortar. Oh. Because I don't think unknown sand actually works. That's a shame. Oh well. The jute in there, and we'll make some bricks. Da, 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 da. I think this is the right recipe. Yes, there we go. Don't know if that's enough, but we've got enough stuff to make some more if need be. So, I need to try and remember what 
it actually looks like it now, <laughs> beehive kiln. Right, let's get started here then. So, a shovel. Oh, let's put some clothes on. Start this up. Grab some of that. So one of the first things we're going to do with this is we're going to build, or we're going to try and build a roof at some point. I still haven't found a proper size amount of a proper significant, it's not a vein, is it? But whatever you call it of, whatever you call it of clay. Do I leave a... I think I leave a thing in the... Yeah, I do. Um, oh, damn it. I was meant to make chimney blocks. Oh, dear. Okay. Cut there. I think this is right, anyway. Um, and then I seal that up after it's done. So, yeah. Let's build a chimney... That should be done. What we do is we can place stuff around here, put some logs down here, we can fire everything up. So, pop them back, call that done for the time being. Don't know if I need those corner blocks, I'm just going to add them anyway. Make it look a bit nicer. One structure done, and I believe that uh, that should be able to set it alight from there. I don't think it needs to go block down, so that's fine. Good, all worked out. So, I did it. <laughs> uh, right now, back to what I was originally. What was the plan? From that end of the video. <laughs> right, I think what I need to do really now is explore a bit more. I've got. I haven't done a huge amount of exploring on this map so far. But I think it would be quite good to explore a little bit. Should I make a should I do some stuff with a chisel actually for the time being? Should I right, should I explore or build the house? I think I think build the house, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make it look nice. So, what I should really be doing is... I'm going to need to chop down a lot of trees. So I've got the axe. I'm going to need to use the chisel and a hammer to make some nice stone blocks. And... I think that's all I need to do, really. Right, so that's, let's do this thing. Oh, well, we'll do it in the morning. It's getting late now. <laughs> Need them, let's pop them. And they're all soaked, so let's hang them up. Why did that do that? With I can't believe I filled those chests already. 
clearly didn't do it properly. Oh well. Let's go to sleep. And we'll get cracking on building this house up. So I'm kind of thinking leave... Or not, obviously not leave the roof as it is, but I'm thinking what I'll do is I will leave this little hut here as, a, as just a bedroom. We'll take the chests out. We'll put that in where where the anvils are. Eventually I will also make a separate little little bit as a as a workshop for for all my metal working stuff. But I think for the time being it's not, not too bad. Let's get just a bit of dirt. I kind of want to use the U logs that. Oh, fine's good. That's over there. So what I might do is try and get some saplings from that and chop them down. Chop down the tree. Sorry. Then we can utilize that. Don't need that. Ooh. Didn't actually mean to get rid of that loom. Let's put that there. All right, come on. We get a drink. Straight away got a sapling. Oh, two. All right. Already in a good place. I don't want to get like maybe five, just so that we've got a decent amount coming in and we can grow them. I mean, I might not even like it as a building material, but I think it'd be quite cool to do. So they look like quite nice logs. Okay, got five. Just do a few more. Right, let's chop this down. As much as I can. Alright, also let me know guys if you think that these videos are a good enough length. I can shorten them if necessary, I just think half an hour is quite good, but I do know that it does take up quite a lot of time, so if people want them to be shorter, let me know. I'm happy to drop them down to about 20 minutes if people would prefer. Um, yeah, just, just let me know. Sticks. Oh, I'm hoping they'll disappear on their own. <laughs> Let's have a look at these then. I think they always spawn in large logs, so it might not be bad. Let's see what they look like if you combine four of them. And then do they always stack the way you're looking? Yeah. I quite like that, okay. Uh, it's going to be a waste for the time being, but... And that's... Now, do they look the same or do they look different? Oh, you can't do it with them. Okay, well, that's a... <laughs> I probably should have done that afterwards. Oh, well. Aren't some of these. Yeah, we don't want the gaff. We do want lots of pine, though. Down the pines.
I don't normally get bronze axes. I don't know why I don't. I think I just always see them as a waste of resources and always stick with stone. Ooh. But no, I should. In the future, I will just make them because it does make a lot more sense. Before I forget, actually, as well, I'm going to start utilizing these and turn them into berry wine. Oh, that hurt. When I place them like that, I forgot blackberries hurt. Pop them down. Right. So what you can do with some? Oh, do I need smooth for? I think I need smooth to make a. What you need to do is you make a ch you make a barrel and then above it you make a little hopper. Yeah, you make a little. You make a hopper out of smooth stone, I believe, bricks. Let's have a look. So, hopper. Here we go. Oh, it's just smooth stone. Right, well, I'll make that, I'll make that later. Let's carry on doing what we were meant to be doing. Making this base. Probably won't do the whole base today, I'll probably do like a, a good section though. Obviously not gonna get the roof done. But I think once I've got once I've got the wood in place, then what I'll do is I'll have to go out and find some clay. I'll probably do it off camera but before the next episode. Just so that I don't know. Just so that it's because I I I do feel like it must be a bit boring just watching me go to go get clay. Let's make it pointy. Okay. It should be fine. Right. Oh no, I don't want to do that. What am I doing? Leave that the same height. I'll do. And that'll be like that. And I suppose I should make them... Let's go down a bit then. Yeah, that'll be fine. Yes, yeah, so that's that should be fine. That goes across like that. And I'll go down. Should be fine. This is a little alcove. We'll see what it looks like once I get the roof on. I don't think that's too bad. Obviously, I need to fix this up because that'll look weird. Yeah, I think that'll be fine. Hmm. One, two, three, one, two, three, four. Yeah, we'll put that one. Wonder if I can make some like window frames or something. That might be quite nice. Yeah, I might do that with different wood. Should I have spruce? What does spruce look like? Yeah, that'd be cool. Right. Two. Three. Two. We could replace this with glass. We'll see how we'll see how it turns out in the end, but it might look quite nice. Is that is that symmetrical? I think so. That looks right. Put that there. That's not going to be even. That's going to be annoying.
Mm, this is going to bug me now. Oh, I'm going to have to break everything if I do that, aren't I? Yeah. All right, I'll be right back once it's done. <laughs> All right, welcome back, guys. Yeah, I've, I'm not, not really happy with it, so I'm probably not going to keep that, but it's better than nothing at the time being. So we're just going to go to bed, call it a day. So I think what we're going to do now is we're going to make us some berry wine, like I said we would. Let's utilize the chisel, do something useful. Finish off the cabbage. Tasty, tasty cabbage. I don't think I actually cooked that in the end, but we should have done that. Oh, I need a ha so I need a hammer to go get some smooth stone. Let's just go grab that. Crops doing well, about fifty percent. So it won't be long, and I'll, oh, I didn't get them in the end. That's fine. So it won't be long until harvesting. I do need to go get some i the ibex as well. I think because they're the nearest animals. And I believe there were male and female ones. Because I could, I found some female cows, like I said in a previous episode, but didn't actually get them because they died. <laughs> So what we're going to have to do, that's make it. Let's make some of these. I think I'm going to want to make quite a few just so that I've got a few hoppers worth. So when we've got some like apples and things coming in, we, we can just churn out as much alcohol and juice as possible. Hey guys, right, I'm back. I end up getting 14 of this. So let's make some of the... Poppers. Right, so I've got two there. Right, let's make some more barrels. Use pine, that's what we got already. Uh, three. I'll do. Ah, I forgot I already had one. Uh, two, three. One, two. And then we need a couple. Just put them there. So what happens if you don't know? You. Oh, let's get rid of the okay from them put them in there and then the smooth stone will just gradually crush that into berry juice which we're getting at the bottom there so i tried basically because that never rots what i'm going to do is just leave that going and as i get more and more berries i'm just going to constantly put that into there um, and then when it's full we'll turn it into berry wine and then we'll have some berry wine which is all good all right now that i've done that let us. What's the t what's the time on this? Uh, yeah, we've got time. Let's go try and get some of those ibex. The more I look at this, the more I just don't like it. I'm just gonna get rid of it. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some fence posts like this one. I'm just gonna chuck that in there instead. I'll try that with the little window first, just to see if it works. Yeah, that's better. I'll I'll do that with the rest of them. Let's chuck some stuff away. We don't need all of this. Right. And make one of these because I seem to be constantly running out of space. Uh, yeah, I'll do. Uh, what am I doing? <laughs> Grab some of these, put them away, and let's go find some. Go find some ibex. I'm thinking what I should do at some point because although I've I've still no, can't talk today. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't have much sleep last night. I wasn't feeling particularly great, so I apologise for that. What I'm thinking is build a bridge across here, and I can have the workshop around here, which means when once I get to the Iron Age, I can make a iron sheet, and I can make some mechanical kerns and stuff out of this if I make a waterfall, make a watermill, which I think will be cool, because I haven't actually used that feature yet. Um, so it'd be cool to try that out. Right, it's the way to the ibex, isn't it? 
Let's have a look. Yeah. I think after I've got these, what I'm going to try and do, probably won't be able to do it this episode because we don't have a huge amount of time left, but I'll um, I'll go have a look for some oats or some other kind of grain just so we can start domesticating them because it'd be nice to have some domesticated animals just before, well, during the first year. Ooh, what's that? We haven't actually done a huge amount of exploring this or this season, really. So what I'd like to do is get set, get some graphite, some kaolinite. We can probably find at least mar uh, graphite in the marble nearby. Kaolinite, I can't remember what. Oh, there's actual sheep here. I thought we just had ibex. Well, these are a lot more useful. Right, they're both male and female. You are a female. You're a male. Excellent. How about you? How about you? Oh, there's loads of them. That is cool. Right. I think I just saw a female over here. Yep. Hello. Right. You're coming with me. How are we going to get around? Have a look on the map. I'm tempted just to go round the coast until I get to there. Be easier that way. Because the problem with doing this is that they get stuck on stuff like um, bushes and things, and it's just yeah, it's just not very. Especially trying to get them up a hill, it's just not very easy. So doing this is the easiest way, really. Let's keep going. Here we are. Excellent. Um, I did a little bit of testing just to see if shader packs would work with with all this. Um, they work, but the frame rate does dip a bit. So I I don't mind giving it a go for an episode. And oh, I didn't realise there's bison here. That's cool. There bison? Yeah. Um, I don't mind giving it a go if um if you want just for an episode. See what you think. Um, it does make it look a lot nicer, but I can always tweak the settings just to make it a bit less. Um, well, a bit less performance heavy. Let's grab this jute. Because my PC isn't particularly great in terms of performance. It can it can run stuff like this in in most games, but it's just the the CPU isn't isn't great, so performing that sort of thing does does affect it quite badly. I do want to do an upgrade at some point, so that should make it a bit easier to do, but it's probably a way off doing that at the moment. Come on then. Oh am I losing everything now? Where did that There we go? Oh no. Come on. I'm getting flashback to when I <laughs> when I had these cows. Come on. There we go. Nearly there. Come on, Mr. Sheepies. Well, Mr. and Mrs. Sheepies. Oh god, this is what I mean, they just get stuck on everything. Come on. Hurry up. Do they walk when it's... Yeah, they do. You need to make sure they don't lose their, their rope. But I suppose at least if they just drop down and go to sleep, it's easier to at least find the rope. You know where they got stuck. I don't want for the zombies spawning.
yay. That was pretty good, seeing as I didn't even mean to to get them. Well, I've got a nice, nice lot of sheep now. Right. Let's go to sleep. How are my berries doing? Why did that not... Weird. 670, that's not bad. Let's go to sleep. I think what I'm going to do off camera is I'm going to go find some clay, dig up as much as possible um, before the next episode, just so that we can start work on this roof. Um, I'm also going to probably play around with that as well, just to make sure it actually looks as good as it can. The more I look at it, the more I'm not overly fussed about those U logs. I'd rather get something like a darker wood. I kind of want Douglas, uh, Douglas fir if I can find it, but the biomes we're in, I'm probably not going to find it at this rate. It's some tasty, tasty beef. Nommy, nommy, nom. Right, so. Do I go get some ibex now? No, I think I'll, I'll get I'll get the ibex another episode. I've got to build another pen anyway, so I think now we'll call it a day here. Uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. If you liked what you saw, please please uh, give a like and subscribe. That would be great. Um, I'm just starting the channel, so any, any help you can give me at this point would be would be amazing. Thank you so much to everyone who's already subscribed. It's 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 been an amazing week, really, just because I've I've had four subscribers now within within a week, really. So that's that's been great. Um, yeah, any any feedback you want to give me as well, please feel free. As I said earlier, I've now got a uh, ooh, chestnut. Now I've got a Discord channel, so if you want to leave feedback there, I'm more than happy to. Also, leave any suggestions and stuff. Um, I'm up for suggestions in terms of future series. So if you've got any games that may be a more obscure or something that I wouldn't have heard of, um, just let me know so I can have a look. Um, it would be great to hear your feedback. Okay, thanks guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.